Greetings, Internet, and welcome once again to another episode of A Comedy Musician Reacts. My name is Insane Ian, I am a comedy musician and comedy music fan, and this week, thanks to my poll on Patreon, I am reacting to two songs by the Stupendium that kind of sound like their other songs, at least in the titles. We have Wake Me Up Before You Goat Goat, the Goat Simulator song, and then Doctor Doctor, his two-point hospital song with Rustage. Yes, there are songs that are called Wake Me Up Before You Go Go. I think that's a Wham song. And Doctor Doctor is also a song I cannot remember who originally does Doctor Doctor. I'm sure some people will tell me in the comments. I just couldn't be arsed to look it up myself. Uh, if this is your first time uh, checking out these videos, uh, it's always uh, a good idea to like, share, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And if you really want to help the channel out, consider supporting me on Patreon, where for just a dollar, you can vote in the poll every week to decide which song I'm going to do a reaction to. And for more than that, you get extra things like the videos early, songs every month, all that cool stuff. But all that out of the way, uh, oh, also, <laughs> if it's your first time seeing me, uh, I pause a lot. It's just a thing. I have, we're actually discussing things. Or, I try to, anyway. Sometimes I ramble, kind of like this intro. Anyway, maybe we should start. Uh-huh. It's just... brains. Oh, a goat stupendium logo. That's... it's almost disturbing. Oh yeah, and subscribe to Stupendium too. Some dude's got a charming town from the farm an alarming sound. I've been charged with a charging round. Now I'm in charge of my body down. Say hello to the Capra Herkers. That's going to the not so learned. Got no permit. Got no purpose. Headless murders at your service. Right from jump. Right from jump. He is. Uh, he's knocking it out of the park with the speed rhymes. Now I said in previous videos. In fact, probably just the last one. That some songs start out a little slow, like the, the Pictures of Spider-Man song started out a little slow. And some people rightfully corrected me in the comments saying that not all of his songs are really fast. And then we start with this one this week. Let's see how it is. I, I see what you're doing. Anyway. Wow. Taking that back for a minute there. That's just, uh. Yeah, what's up? And the beat is crazy, too. Some dogs got a charming town from the farm, an alarming sound. I've been charged with a charging round, now I'm in charge of my body down. Say hello to the Capra Herkus. That's going to the not so learned. Got no permit, got no purpose. Headless murders at your service. Universe is staunch as critic. Never thought much about the laws of physics. I'm a nuisance in a whole nuisance. Newton never glued tongue to a civic. I'm a nuisance in a whole new sense. Newton never glued his tongue to a civic. If there is no greater phrase to describe Goat Simulator than that, I don't know what is. Ha! Oh, that is, that's some amazing bars. And also, I need to point out just how incredible Goat Pendium is. That, that goat outfit with Stoops's mutton-chopped, mustached face popping through. I don't know how that makes me feel inside. I don't know if I'm disturbed or not. I might be. I might be pretty disturbed by that. That's, uh... That's definitely a thing. And also, this is just a great pre-pause screen of him just going, Ooh! Ooh! <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, Goat Simulator is just a weird game. If you haven't played it, you play as a goat and you run around causing havoc and rescuing goats and just doing different tasks around the level and you have this prehensile tongue that gets stuck on things and you can get dragged by cars with it and launched off of rockets holding on it, game's messed up is what I'm saying 
Wow. Let's go to the not so learned, got no planet, yeah. got no manners, hermes, murderers, and your service. You are the system, just critic. Never thought much about the laws of physics. I'm a nuisance, did a whole nuisance, Newton, never glued tongue to a civic. Fools, I don't care if you go to the gym. You know that you control your limbs, get to leave more ragdolls yeah. and rosy at gym. So duck when I'm up, but you go for a swim. Wow. <laughs> more ragdolls than Rosie and Jim. Wow. <laughs> Of physic. I'm a nuisance, did a whole new says Newton, never glued tongue to a civic. Fools, I don't care if you go to the gym. You know that you control your limbs, get to leave more ragdolls and rows of your gym. So duck when I'm up, but you go for a swim. I'm on last board, it's a long black horn, like a compact horse full of impact thoughts. It's fact, if a thing is intact, then I gotta hit that shadow to bring back scores one but <sighs> This is going so fast, my brain can't process it. I'm really thankful for the lyrics being on the screen and him just popping around in the corners while it's just over game footage is simplistic yet immensely effective for this oh my gosh oh the brain melting goodness uh huh also the go to the gym flex just and as as in the game the good is wrecking a gym uh, good stuff control your limbs get to leave more ragdolls and rows of your gym so duck when I'm up but you go for a swim on one last board it's a long black horn like a combat horse full of impact thoughts it's, it's combat horse it's kind of thing intact that I gotta hit that shadow to bring back scores one buff to your bumper and your flambe now nah, you know the meaning of a ram raid yeah there was a giraffe in there there's there's like an expansion where y you it's like the game uh oh god I wanna say payback but it is it is it payback it's a it's a bank robbing first person shooter you're, you're on a team of four i think it's called payback uh there was an expansion that was a, a payback expansion where you had a team of other animals that cause havoc one was a giraffe and one was a dolphin in a wheelchair and there's a there's a, a a goat simulator mmo expansion that makes it an rpg and there's a, a space expansion and game is nuts I, I didn't notice in the oh, when I buck you're going for a swim he's standing on the beach in the game <laughs> wow back home like a combat horse full of impact thoughts it's fact if a thing is intact then I gotta hit that shadow to bring back scores one buck to your bumper and your flambe now you know the meaning of a ram raid with a shiner so bright you might hop that bad day down for a lap shade no surprise for an angular under the sun to come on one a gum ripple who'd wonder with under the gum with day he was under and under the fun of a stumble in front of a muscle and he busted force of a blunder but call me a musk kid ask that beat up beat you beat call me a musk kid talking about a blunderbuss call me a musk kid like meaning musket like a, a rifle but since it's a goat a baby goat is a kid bars on bars just not so triumphant and ungulate oh my god every line of this a poem <laughs> No such way I'm putting on your own The sun took him on a gum ripple Who'd wonder with under his gum with day He was under and under the thud of his tumble In front of a muscle and he busted Pulse of a blunder but school me a musky It asked that beat up beat you bleed That gets you a shoe and feed you majestic <laughs> The whole first verse, man We're just now getting to the hook That is insanity Best get your insurance adjusted Ugh it's, That's the best description for all the NPCs in that game and uh, and then we get into goat worship for the chorus. Oh my goodness! And sure as mountain breaks the skies, a noble hero shall arise. One chosen, who so bold and true, <laughs> with cloven hooves and the MMO. Right of his so twisted and deformed, the kingdom rests upon oh, his bones. We just can't say if we'll be slain along the way to fame. So, uh, stopping here for a second, yes, the five stupendiums singing in unison is impressive and, uh, good effect around the cauldron that's broadcasting the game. One of those swords, the one on the very right, is pink and blurred out. And, uh, I think it's blurred out. I don't think it's, like... 8-bit. I think it's it's been pixelated to uh, hide what it is. And the only thing I can think of it being 
is the Saints Row dildo sword. That's a thing. Uh, that, like, it's in the game, and it's also a physical thing that they made, and that's... Admittedly, that's purple, so I don't know if this is the same thing, but regardless, that is a blurred out sword, and I'm disturbed. <laughs> These verses are so amazing, and, and I have to say, uh, I am a little disappointed that the hook doesn't have a riff on Wake Me Up Before You Go-Go, uh, but uh, maybe that'll come in later. Uh, I always appreciate when when we, we do a sample or an, an interpolation of a pop song like he does in uh, Why Did I Say Okie Dokie, and he, he does a riff on Just the Two of Us uh, several times. Uh, I'm, I'm hoping that that will pop up in this and also in the next song. Uh, but, uh, this verse is so ridiculous. I, because goats are kind of a internet meme thing anyway, I'm half expecting there to be more screaming goat sounds. Just cause. Storming, I'll smash your teeth in gymnastic feet. This elastic beast is performing. My skeletal structure is a bit of a mystery. Pardon, darling, you must have missed me. I've been the garden, I've been the city. One heck of a flex, but I'm extra twisted. Bit of a stretch, all the damage I do, cause I'm pretty adept. Dash climb a hoof to the fence on my head. It jams the roof, don't care what the dead's really climbing to do. When I bleed, I leave no survivors. I'm a freak with adhesive saliva. One. I'm a freak with adhesive saliva. How's that for no context? Uh. Lick of the tongue and your fish will flung and let you click to become a subscriber. I can be a tool goat, I can be a small goat, I can be a belly even goat like a tall goat. Okay. We've got repeating Dan Bowles here. And other people who I sorry I don't recognize. There's there's somebody, there's Dan, there's somebody who was the somebody from before, there's Dan again, there's Stupendium, there's Dan, there's that somebody who I don't recognize, and I guess Dan. It's blocked by something on my screen that won't show up in the video. Uh the dead really climbing to do when I bleed I leave no survivors. I am a freak with a decent saliva. One lick of the tongue and your fish will flung and let you click to become a subscriber. I can be such a great one. I can be a belly even goat like a tall goat with an attribute of particularly random baby that you grapple with a sore throat. David Attenborough would grapple with a sore throat. Wow. Cause you know it's it's the uh National Geographic David Attenborough kind of nature video thing that he's talking about. Uh, David Attenborough uh, narrates nature videos of, of that nature and nature videos of that nature. Ah, I'm repetitively redundant. Uh, yeah, so good and stupid. The D's of saliva. One lick of the tongue and your fish will flung and let you click to become a subscriber. I could be a tall goat, I could be a small goat, I could be a belly even goat, I could all go with that. That could be a fellow around and baby. Yes, with a bull and you get the horns. That bull's got nothing on a Capricorn. That bull's got nothing on a Capricorn. Shout out to the January birthdays. January birthdays. Like mine. January 1st. Yes, that is absolutely true. I was born on New Year's Day. It's great. People have a countdown to my birthday, they drop a ball on my birthday. The Chinese celebrated on the wrong day. The Jews too. Anyway. Jeff, we just kept trying and the jet back climbing to get back kind of back to store in and out of the beetle day. It's a beetle bread or a microwave. Don't you just be running around with a microwave. I forgot about that. <laughs> yes, you are an anthropomorphic microwave with legs in the RPG MMO game of it. Uh, just, just so, so ridiculous. Being a giant. Uh, sperm whale. Just, uh, I, how, the game this ridiculous deserves a song this ridiculous. Absolutely. Horns, that bull's got nothing on a Capricorn. Kept just kept trying to jet back climbing to get back. I'm about to storm in and out. It's not the beetle day. It's a beetle bread or a microwave. Don't need to flee. See every species are just to go with a coat of pain. Now I'm done. Your town has arrived. I've got no thumb to accomplish a mic drop. One tip, if it's badly your life, stop living and rather the side of the livestock. <laughs> there we go into the space one. 
Crashing in depravity Crashing in depravity Yikes Galilee galaxy Last hope for the galaxy Great rhyme scheme. Great rhyme scheme carrying over. He gallops, he... Uh, it's, it's, uh... Mm. Ah. <laughs> we are science! I know that's a game, but... All five of them looking at cam looking to the camera. It's so good. Wow. Bravo. Thanks for watching, and thanks to my unbelievable patrons who decided to pick me for their generous support. If you enjoyed, be sure to ram that like button, comment, and subscribe. Ram the and like button. And while you're here, why not check out the playlist for more? Be sure to take a look at the Patreon gore at the merch store too. I bet Ooh, you were out finding the more goat puns at this end card. It would quite hurt to think I'm all them. Zero. Quite heard to think of Oridum. Oh. And there were a couple in there that I that I didn't point out as as goat puns, because number one, his puns are so sneaky, some of them slip by me, but like the capricious something or other that he said after Capricorn, that that is, I'm sure, another uh genus or something for another type of goat or or something along those lines. It's just uh it's amazing the amount of research he does for his lyrics and his wordplay and it's just so solid all the way through i can't think of a song that of his that just does not have absolute perfection from end to end as far as uh lyrical content and dedication to to the writing on it that's just fantastic stuff uh, and then now we go on to Two Point Hospital. Sorry about that. Once that finishes. I can't see that without thinking of the opening of Like a Surgeon by Weird Al, where the, the heart meter starts up again and then it becomes the beat in the song. Quality stuff. And having it turn into his glasses on that, that's quality. Mime crisis. Thank you. Welcome to Two Point. It's the place to be. From a famous little ailment all the way to A and E. Your <laughs> death count was quite shameful to see. So now you'll have to pay to get away from that disease. Private healthcare. It's the way it's meant to be. And <laughs> just the cheerful private healthcare. <laughs> I'm very easily amused. <laughs> to be from a painless little ailment all the way to A&E. Your county's death count was quite shameful to see, so now you'll have to pay to get away from that disease. Private healthcare, it's the way it's meant to be. Where's the welfare? When you're getting it for free, but it's welfare. Just Ooh. beware of the receipt. Two points, the only joint for medical relief. Check in, we'll get you diagnosed, though the wait's a little long. I hope you bought a change of clothes. A patient must be patient, make the waiting room your home. Just do your best not to pay attention to the ghost. So yeah, uh, Two Point Hospital is a kind of sim game where you are building a hospital and trying to make sure that you're taking care of all the patients that are coming in with their particular ailments. And uh, it's it's a it's one of those micromanagement games where you're kind of uh, moving around the the map of your hospital and uh, making sure that these patients are getting taken care of, that this place is doing this, like this research is happening so that you can build this machine so that you can take care of the patients faster and better and get more money into the hospital to raise the hospital's score. And if patients die in the hospital, their ghosts haunt the hospital. And then you have to get like something to get rid of the ghosts. Like, is there a Ghostbuster in the game? Kind of, they're probably not called that, but uh yeah like the the mime crisis 
uh, poster behind him, the silent killer. That's one of the diseases in the game, I think, is where people become mime and can't talk, but can just be stuck in glass boxes that they can't get out of and die. Uh, that's a thing you have to cure. Uh, yeah, this is a game. <laughs> Check in! We'll get you diagnosed, though the wait's a little long. I hope you brought a change of clothes. A patient must be patient, make the waiting room your home. Just do your best not to pay attention to the ghosts. Yeah, even if, like, you're taking care of them and they die, that's one thing, but they could be waiting and die because you haven't gotten enough doctors into the hospital to get through the people waiting in the waiting room. Waiting room. I almost said waiting office, and then my mouth made other choices. Two coin hospitals, the only place to be. But we're required to say there's other options legally. <laughs> We swear that we prepared for you the very best of care With medical professionals and specialists to spare We found them on the internet, but really don't be scared Though one or two are doctorates in crayon to be found Doctor of Medicine by David D. Davidson <laughs> oh, Awarded to David D. Davidson That's that's probably how I would look like as a doctor I've always said I, I should be a doctor solely on the fact that my handwriting is terrible We swear that we prepared for you the very best of care With medical professionals and specialists to spare We found them on the internet, but really don't be scared Though one or two are doctorates in crayon to be fair Screw the anesthetic, truly it's pathetic oh, the Whistles, pans. pan wearings, the new pandemic. It's a pandemic, because they've got pans on the... PANS! Admittedly, this is not Stupendium's fault, these are in the game Although I don't know if that specific one is So it might be his fault We'll figure out blame later. Despair! We found them on the internet, but really don't be scared, though. One or two are doctorates in crayon, to be fair. Screw the anesthetic, truly it's pathetic. With source pan wearings, the new pandemic. <laughs> the one in the orange shirt in the back is stupendium. <laughs> Doctor, I'm feeling a bit lightheaded. I'm a regular fixture, rip it out, slot a head in. Uh, when I step into the scene, <laughs> moving and grooving my body's ways you've never seen. Cha cha, slide up into the GP. You say I need treatment, what the hell do you mean? I know this is day, fever. Writing paintings <laughs> at the tape to awake the next day as an arrangement of shapes. Essential oils may have been the start. Remember, medicine is not a science, it's an art. <laughs> I've just been called from our legal team, it is in fact a science. Apologies. Yeah, that's. Some people think it is an art and right, not a science. Anyway. Right, that will be 200. 200? What? 200 what? Now you're at least 350. Right, Puns! Sometimes, a uh, reaction to Stupendium songs is just me screaming the word puns at the camera. I've just decided. Oh. Is in fact a science. Apologies. <laughs> right, that will be 200. 200? What? 200 what? Now you're at least 350. Private healthcare! The way it's meant to be. Comfy desk chairs. Add a few fatalities. But we'll learn <laughs> a little something out of every tragedy. So your death won't be for nothing. Well, that's a guarantee. No matter what you're coming down with, I know that we can handle it. I just saw 20 clowns climbing out a tiny ambulance. I like a throat of mummy and a mammoth case of flatulence. And 30 Freddy Mercury does wonders for the ambience. 30 Freddie Mercury's does wonders for the ambience. Wow. That's another great four bar verse there. Oh, that's so, that whole thing was so good. What, what was it? it it's 20, clients, 20 clowns climbing out a tiny ambulance, which is, yeah, that's a like Massive, <laughs> mammoth case of flatulence. Just... Yeah, I think all of these are Mammoth in the game. Mammoth case of flatulence and 30 Freddy Mercury does wonders for the ambience. Two coin hospital trialobotomies. <laughs> and if you aren't satisfied, get your next one for free. Mm. I'm feeling blue and can't express it to you. But with the doctors at this hospital, I'm 50 shades of screwed. I'm not doing so great, it's Grey's Anatomy. A matter of these doctors using colorful vocabulary. I like that verse a lot. Very kung fu. Uh, a seizure? Uh, rapping. I guess rapping. The mind's crazy. Cairo Practor. 
It's not even a lyric. It's just because he's he's just moaning, and it's just the 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 text on the screen, subtitles in this case, uh, saying his Cairo practor, because Cairo is a place in Egypt, and most mummies are are thought to be uh, Egypt Egyptian in origin, and I. This pun physically hurt me. Which means I love it. Rapping, rapping, rapping. rapping. Oh, no, he's rapping as a mind. It's just Pyramid scheme. Uh, I'm not a criminal jail. I'm afraid of that. But with my condition, I've stolen all of my neighbor's cats. Before we operate, <laughs> there's form to get to fill. To say we're not responsible if we mess up the drill. Our honest interrogative is not to get you killed. Because the patients who don't make it have no way to pay the bill. That's important. <laughs> that is that is almost uh, not to compare to Weird Al again, but that's almost the scene where they're operating and patting down Al's head, and he's going in with the forceps to remove hundred dollar bills from the patient's wallet. Private health care. <laughs> And My Rusted, doing great operate, places as all the, uh, to to patients not and then dancing in the background. The drill. So Our good. Honest interrogative is not to get you killed, because the patients who don't make it have no way to pay the bill. I've treated many sickly beans with bloaty heads to keep the beans, and if they're dead, it simply means an open bed or quarantine. The policy is quality with all the best technology, which operate radiology, biology, orthology, bionic ornithology, and chronic escapology, demonic Egyptology, I'll give to this beyond belief. Lightheadedness. The light bulb. And all of those ologies. Wow. And then ending that with beyond belief. Ah, so good. An inspection? No prob at all. Can't fake perfection, but we're phenomenal. Doctor, I think I'm addicted to petting zoos. Oh? And what are your symptoms? Well, I've been feeling a little hoarse for weeks. <laughs> Puns! Private healthcare! The way it's meant to be. There's a method to the matter, same at every malady. We're the best you can afford, and the Yelp scores agree. We've got the best shade of grey morality. Uh, medical practices, this is what you call it. I would have got the same experience if I burnt my wallet. I'm rating this place one out of five, but I've got no choice if I want to stay alive. Yeah, that's the whole thing, is the getting the ratings for the hospital. So good. Two point hospitals, impossible to beat. The costs are astronomical, cough up or you're deceased. Puns. Uh, Doctor, I keep forgetting what an airport building is called. I'm so sorry. It's terminal. Private healthcare! It's the way it's meant to be. Don't go elsewhere, or we'll lose our subsidies. Ignore the screens! Have a seat, a cup of tea. At two point, you should make a full recovery. You should. Ignore our poor mortality That's rates. I'm sure fire. we can charge more. Tally the rates. Yes, we can. Wow, ignore our mortality rates. I'm sure we can afford more. Tally the rates. Whoa. Man. His verbiage, his vocabulary flips. Which, technically, they're puns. They are stunning punchlines. When, when he's on with them, he's really on with them. Man, that's good. Ignore the screams! Have a seat, a cup of tea! At two point, you should make a full recovery! Ignore our poor mortality rates! I'm sure we can charge more tally the rates! Yes, we can get a little bit carried away, but ignoring all the flaws, tell me how would you stay? Ignoring all the flaws! for comical <laughs> disease! We honestly can promise that we'll probably succeed! Probably. Wow. Never have I heard a more accurate estimation of healthcare. Thank you for coming in to see me today. I do hope the music in the lobby wasn't too tiresome. I'm going to prescribe you with a daily dose of stupendium, so do please hit the prescribe button below, and then fill out a customer feedback form, like, comment, and then ring the bell at the front desk when you're done. I'd like to thank Dr. Rusty for his help with his diagnosis. Uh, do please pop in and see him in his office when we're done here. And don't forget to buy a lovely stupendium t-shirt or mug in the gift shop on the way out.
Do have a lovely day. And that will be £4,000. <laughs> I love the in-character outros the most. Uh, last week's with uh, pictures of Spider-Man as, as J. Jonah Jameson, and this week as the doctor hitting the prescribed button and ring the bell at the desk. That's uh, quality stuff. Great, great bars from Stupendium and uh, an awesome guest appearance by Rustage as the various patients. That was excellent. Nine out of ten doctors agree that the Stupendium is on iTunes, Google Play, Spotify, and many other platforms. Oh, quality end cards. Ah, bravo for both of those. Uh, again, titles that uh, actually aren't even in the song on those. Wake Me Up Before You Goat Goat is never said in that song, and Doctor Doctor is never said like that in this song. They say doctor a lot, uh, but uh, yeah, that was uh, that was unique that I chose these two to pair together because of their similar titles to existing songs, and then those never made it in there. Cool, that's the way things work out. Anyway, hopefully you enjoyed these videos, uh, and if you want to see the originals, they're of course in the description down below. Please, if you've made it to the end, check out the credits, and uh, like, share, comment, subscribe, and if you really want to help me out, check out my Patreon at patreon.com slash insaneian. Thanks very much, we'll see you next time. Bye. I kind of said it weird that time. Oh well. Spaghetti and bicycle. How do you ride it? Spaghetti and bicycle. What does it mean? Spaghetti and bicycle. None of your business. Spaghetti and bicycle. Super extreme. Cooking up flapjacks is the morning routine before heading to the daily grind. Staple some paper.